It's no fun being called a moron by your Secretary of State. So when that subject came up during President Trump's interview with Forbes... He's saying, let's take an IQ test. An intelligence duel. The president's actual words, I think it's fake news. But if he did that, I guess we'll have to compare IQ tests. And I can tell you who is going to win. It's far from the first time he's bragged about his brains. I know I have an IQ better than all of them. I guarantee you, my IQ is much higher than any of these people. Then there was the time he was asked what experts he consults. I'm speaking with myself, number one, because I have a very good brain. He's repeatedly tweeted about his very high IQ. Sorry, losers and haters, but my IQ is one of the highest. And now he's challenging his own Secretary of State. In no time, people began proposing a sort of IQ face-off live on TV. One night only, Trump, Tillerson, IQ test, pay-per-view, loser resigns. I know words, I have the best words. At least Rex Tillerson didn't use these words to describe the president. What are you? An idiot sandwich. Take it from one of the smartest people on earth. When asked his IQ, Stephen Hawking answered, People who boast about their IQ are losers. Genimo, CNN. I guarantee my IQ is much higher than any of these people. Likewise. New York.